Have you ever wondered what the world would look like if dinosaurs still lived? These incredible creatures ruled the Earth for millions of years and continue to fascinate both scientists and nature enthusiasts to this day. In this video, you will learn what dinosaurs were when they lived and how they became extinct. You will also discover the most important types of dinosaurs and find out whether they truly disappeared completely from our planet. What were dinosaurs? Dinosaurs were a group of prehistoric reptiles that dominated the Earth for millions of years. They were primarily land animals, although some species could fly or swim. Dinosaurs came in various sizes, from tiny ones, as small as a chicken, to gigantic ones that grew up to several dozen meters in length. Scientists have discovered hundreds of dinosaur species and continue to find new fossils, helping us better understand their lives. When did dinosaurs live? Dinosaurs first appeared on Earth about 230 million years ago, during an era known as the Mesozoic. At that time, the Earth's conditions were very different from today. The climate was warmer, Continents were in different positions and the plants and animals were unlike those we see now. The Mesozoic era is divided into three periods, the Triassic, Jurassic and Cretaceous. In each of these periods, new dinosaur species emerged and adapted to the ever-changing world. When were the first dinosaurs discovered? The first discoveries of dinosaur fossils date back to the 17th century. In 1677, museum curator Robert Plott described a large bone, but he mistakenly believed it to be the remains of a biblical giant. It wasn't until the 19th century that systematic research on these prehistoric reptiles began. A breakthrough came in 1824 when the remains of giant lizards such as Megalosaurus were found and identified. Further discoveries caught the attention of British scientist Richard Owen, who, in 1842, recognized the unique characteristics of these creatures. He coined the term dinosaurs, creating a completely new category in the animal kingdom. When and why did dinosaurs go extinct? For millions of years, dinosaurs dominated the Earth, achieving incredible diversity and adapting to various environments. It is no surprise that their sudden extinction continues to intrigue paleontologists who seek answers to what led to this catastrophic event. One of the most widely accepted theories points to an asteroid impact approximately 66 million years ago. The consequences of this impact were catastrophic, triggering a series of dramatic events that gradually led to the extinction of the dinosaurs. Scientists have identified five major consequences of this disaster. A massive shockwave. The explosion was so powerful that it instantly wiped out many species of animals and plants. Extreme temperature rise. The impact heated the atmosphere to such an extent that it caused massive wildfires, making survival nearly impossible. Gigantic tsunamis. Due to the arrangement of the continents at the time, the waves had vast areas to travel across, increasing their destructive power. Increased seismic and volcanic activity, earthquakes and volcanic eruptions released enormous amounts of toxic gases into the atmosphere, further worsening living conditions. Nuclear winter, dust and soot lingering in the atmosphere blocked sunlight, leading to a long-term cooling of the climate. For the warm adapted dinosaurs, this was a fatal blow. As a result of these cascading disasters, Earth's ecosystems collapsed and dinosaurs, unable to adapt to the new, harsh conditions, became extinct. In their place, new groups of animals emerged, marking the rise of mammals and opening a new chapter in the history of life on our planet. The most important types of dinosaurs Dinosaurs varied greatly, but they are primarily divided into two main groups, herbivores and carnivores. Predatory dinosaurs. These were fearsome carnivorous dinosaurs that hunted other animals. They had sharp teeth, powerful jaws, and were very fast. The most famous representative of this group is Tyrannosaurus rex. T. 
T-Rex was one of the largest land predators in history, reaching up to 12 meters, 39 feet in length, and weighing up to nine tons. Although it had short forelimbs, its powerful legs and agility made it an extremely effective hunter. Velociraptor. Velociraptor was a fast and intelligent predator, measuring about two meters, 6.5 feet in length and weighing up to 15 kilograms, 33 pounds. It had sharp curved claws on its hind legs, which it used for hunting smaller dinosaurs. Spinosaurus. Spinosaurus was the largest known carnivorous dinosaur reaching up to 18 meters, 59 feet in length and weighing up to 10 tons. It was distinguished by its elongated snout and adaptations for an aquatic lifestyle, making it an excellent fish hunter. Its characteristic sail-like structure on its back, formed by tall neural spines, may have been used for temperature regulation or to intimidate rivals. Allosaurus Allosaurus was one of the dominant predators of the late Jurassic period, growing up to 9 meters, 30 feet in length, and weighing around 2 tons. It had powerful jaws with serrated teeth and strong muscular hind legs, which gave it significant speed. Allosaurus hunted large herbivorous dinosaurs, and its hunting strategy may have included pack attacks. Herbivorous giants, these were some of the largest animals ever to walk the earth. They had long necks and tails, allowing them to reach high trees. The most famous representative of this group is Brachiosaurus. Brachiosaurus was a gigantic sauropod, reaching up to 25 meters, 82 feet in length, and weighing up to 50 tons. Its long front legs and extended neck allowed it to reach leaves from tall trees, making it one of the tallest dinosaurs. Due to its massive size, it had few natural predators, and its huge lungs may have allowed it to hold its breath for long periods. Triceratops. Triceratops is one of the most recognizable herbivorous dinosaurs, known for its three horns and a large bony frill protecting its neck. It measured about 9 meters, 30 feet in length, and weighed up to 12 tons, making it one of the largest horned dinosaurs. With its powerful jaws and scissor-like teeth, it could efficiently chew tough vegetation. Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus was characterized by rows of large bony plates along its back, which likely served for defense or temperature regulation. It measured about 9 meters, 30 feet in length and weighed up to 5 tons, but it had a relatively small brain compared to its massive body. Its teeth were not suited for chewing tough plants, so it likely fed on soft vegetation and ferns. Did dinosaurs really go extinct? Although the large land-dwelling dinosaurs disappeared, their close relatives are still alive today. Birds. Scientists have discovered that many dinosaur traits, such as feathers, were present in some theropods. Today, every sparrow, eagle or chicken is a distant descendant of these prehistoric giants. Dinosaurs continue to fascinate scientists and children around the world. Every year, new fossils are discovered, helping us better understand their lives. Who knows, maybe one day you will discover a new species of dinosaur.